Hey everybody, the Bong is back. Let's play Soul Blazer Part 17. If you saw the conclusion of the last video, we just killed Poseidon who had the hair of an Osmond and now we're going to release the, release the king. Are you okay? Of course he's okay. He was just, you know, just trapped by Poseidon in a, some kind of rock, turned into a soul. Or... Pretty sure he was getting some Poontang while he was in there, but whatever. Time before I see the king, there's a shortcut to it. How did you get in? Here, I'll give you this. I received the master's emblem, E. Awesome. E for excellent. In the meantime, let's just go see the king, shall we? I am a magician. If you collect the master's three symbols, I will call the phoenix. You saved me? Thank you very much. I treated the snail gnome very poorly. I would not trust all the things no one was saying. He told me monsters would invade our town. I put him in prison. <laughs> See, no, I believe you will find who you are looking for. By the way, have you heard of the Phoenix? Whoever collects the master's three symbols, the red hot mirror, the red hot ball, and the red hot stick, shall have the Phoenix help them. That person will inherit the strongest power. If you collect them all, bring them to me. Okay, so not only do I have to collect emblems, I also gotta collect uh, red hot items, which I don't have any of. So we're off to a good start there, <laughs> like, three items, so far we have zero. My name is Gnome. I used to live in Dr. Leo's house. Dr. Leo was asked by King Magrid to build a machine that would call upon evil. Because he refused, he was taken to Magrid Castle. He secretly gave us four stones and told us to run away. Those stones are key to the world of evil. The other stones are in Dr. Leo's laboratory and in Castle Madrid. Here, take this silver stone and hurry to the laboratory where Dr. Leo was held. Alright, then let's go there, shall we? We got everything we need here. Well, we're going to have to come back here later, but whatever. How can I help you? Eh, we'll just uh, do an in-game save rather than an emulator save. Just in case, you know, it wouldn't hurt to have security. Yeah, that's a very dilapidated lab, if you ask me. <laughs> this is Dr. Leo's laboratory. There are machines lurking around here which only the powerful Zantetsu store can defeat. First of all, talk to a certain door to get you into the room. Holy shit, the doors are talking to me! Oh man, this is what happens when you're on drugs, man. Oh, this music looks kinda awesome. I'm gonna kill some bugs. 19? 19 monster layers here? That's a lot of layers. Is that Rosie from the Jetsons or something? Cleaning robots? It's a great door. What makes him so great? He's just a door like everyone else. He doesn't deserve greater honor. Okay, those are the monsters I cannot kill. So, I will have to leave this place. And come back later. Yeah, there's a Tantetsu sword. But, before we go there, I have some backtracking to do. A lot of backtracking. You'll see what I mean later, so... First, let's go all the way back to Grass Valley. Now that we got the Santetsu sword, these things can die! Finally, kill these things. Get some special monster layers released there. Or at least some ivy. Okay, that's good. Or at least I gained a level here, so I'll be a bit stronger for those mecha monsters back at the lab. This way. Okay, we can do that. Oh, that's all of them. 
Oh, at least some more IV. Okay, that takes me to uh, an empty passage, but trust me, that passage is going to be very important. Ooh, treasure! Now see tornado magic. Okay, there's three, two other spells I need to get before the tornado magic is even considered. So I'm gonna have to get those later in the game. So let's not worry about that. Let's go around the areas where we just released the layers. First, we go this way. Get up there. I am watching over the world. Please take this sword. Oh, I received an even stronger sword, the Recover Sword. And what this sword does is that you actually gain life every time you kill a monster. But we're not going to use that yet because we still need the Santetsu Sword for important reasons. Okay, there's some ivy here that we got to go up. And we got the Master's Emblem A now. How about that? How many emblems do we have so far? We have one, two, five. Yeah, we got five. So that's pretty good. We're making some progress. That means we're more than halfway done. Yeah, no, nope. two more places to go. Of course, one is Greenwood. Let's go this way because that's closest to the fire shrine. It feels good to kill those lizards in one hit. Now let's find those metal scorpions. Let's go over here. Oh, there's another one. Well, apparently there's still more in this room alone. That's all of them. Ooh, what's this? Oh, you only get one experience point? The thing is, you can get that one experience point infinite times. So you can actually find a place for infinite experience, that is, if you got the patience to get one every time you talk to them. find all the scorpions here. Okay, and the shrine's in the upper right corner, that way you won't get lost. So as soon as you hear an explosion, you know where to go. Oh, there it is. Oh, treasure chest. It could be here. Another strange bottle. That didn't seem very useful, but we'll take it. Might as well, it's the spoils of battle. Uh, let's equip the uh, ice armor, so just so we can go through them fire paths without actually having to stop. Okay, and there's scorpions here too, so... Oh, there's two, right there. Die, wretched scorpion, come here! Uh, is there still more? There's... So far, I think it's only this last one. Yep, it is. Uh, or at least a bird. I have to see that bird later on. Time. Let's get the hell out of here. If we find a gem, just go back. That'd be great. Oh, let's go this way. Yeah, I'll go back. Now, that's not all the monster layers I need to release in Greenwood, but the only ones I can release at this time. I heard of the Phoenix Match when I visit the Soul of the Mountain. If you collect the three symbols, you should visit the Mountain King. That's it? That's all you got to say? Like, I already knew that. Come on, hey, give me something good. Fine, don't give me something good, then. Oh, there's 
so we got one place that's left to go. We need to go over all the way to uh, Durian and kill that rock con. And we will do that. Now let's get a little closer before we stop the video. Okay, let's get the bubble armor ready. Next time on Let's Play Soul Blazer, this is the Banga signing off saying goodbye and see you all later.